welcome back once again to another toilet time. That's right, guys. And my toilet tip for today simply is this. Do not have your friends accompany you to the restroom, especially when it's an explosive event. Ew. Why would your friends join you with that anyway? Dope. Guys, before we get into this video, let's go over the comment of the week. That is by a person named Pixel Gamer, and Pixel Gamer says they should make the We Love You play button. If they did, I would buy it for you one million times. Well, thank you. I love you guys too. You guys are all amazing, and I just hope you guys stay with me for years and years to come into the future and help this community grow. You guys are all awesome. So stay that way, guys. Just stay that way. And uh, um, guys, let's set a like goal for this video of 100 likes. I know you guys can do it because you guys know how to slap that like button. And uh, without further ado, guys, let's get into this video, shall we? What's up, guys? And welcome back once again to another Lumber Tycoon 2 guys and um as some of you guys know there's a new update to uh, um lumber tycoon 2 where there is some now some freaking uh, halloween stuff i have a black and purple pumpkin here i don't know what he is like i think trying to give me this piece of wood that is a big piece of uh redwood there that's um that's massive all right so yeah guys i am <laughs> Wow, I am overloaded here. These guys have gotten me some awesome gifts. So that's that's freaking cool. Look at this redwood. I mean, this big freaking log. Um, wow, I don't know even where to put this. Um, this thing is just massive, and I'm trying to get it. Oh! Can I? Oh, no, no, no. It's on a truck. That's not good. That's not good. It's never good when wood is on the truck. There we go. Alright, so I have that there. Uh, this is crazy. These guys are, are just hooking me up with a lot of stuff. So let me handle all these donations. And a big shout out to everyone here. Big Panda 369, Junior Alt, um, Aovir Deer, and uh, Starmine 143. Um, that's awesome, guys. You guys are, are freaking awesome. And just wow. Look at all this stuff. I mean, nice. All right, so I'm back. I got all that stuff up to the love wall. is really looking crazy. And how is there a truck? Okay. Last time when I left, this truck was upright. Now, how is it sideways? I have absolutely no clue. I just don't know how this stuff happens to me. These trucks have a mind of their freaking own. Like... Seriously, that's crazy. All right, one thing I know, I need more white wood, guys, because we got to continue making this garage. We got to finish the freaking garage, guys. Let me um follow these guys first because they want me to follow them, and um, we'll be right back. All right, so guys, I'm back, and they're actually leading me, I guess, to where oh, where the Halloween um, stuff is being sold right now. So I guess it's being sold in this shack in the corner here, and um, I'm interested to see what all is in this shop. So we're going to show this stuff off, guys. Um, the new Halloween update from Defaultio. Oh, look at that, guys. That's where the purple pumpkins are. Nice, and from what they're saying, there's going to be new items added, like skulls and eyeballs and stuff like that, too, so, cool. That's awesome, so, um, shout out to, uh, um, to Junior and, uh, um, um, A Over Deer for, uh, showing me where this stuff is, so, that's freaking cool. So, right now, guys, I gotta head back, and we're gonna go get some white wood, and, uh, um... Continue building that garage, because we gotta get that garage built. I wanna store all my conveyors and stuff, 
and get that all done. So I'll be right back once I get to the White Wood location. All right, guys, so I'm up here, and um, I am building with, or, well, I'm cutting down some white trees here, so that way we can uh, continue building. And I've got a couple of other people up here helping me out, so this should go by hopefully a lot quicker, and we'll be able to get plenty of white wood to do what we need. So I think I need to move my truck a little bit closer. Oh, crap. And that happened. That definitely happened. It did not actually go in my truck like I wanted it to. So let me uh, move this truck closer here. So that way I can uh, put the white wood in the actual truck. <laughs> so we're going to do this like this. All right. And so let's chop up some of this white wood and I'll be right back, guys. All right, guys. So I'm back here and I have a freaking um, full truck here and I had he he I believe has a full truck too so we are going to oh no oh no I did not expect there to be a tree right there to knock all my stuff oh guys this is what happens when I don't pay attention crap all right so let me fix this and then we'll head back into town and then process everything in my uh, in my thing and um, start building again all right, guys. So I am back in the uh, um, into my base here, and now we can turn in all of this. And um, they're already throwing some in there, which is awesome. So the wood is um, piling up there at the ends, and we'll be able to use this for for the uh, completion of this garage. I don't know if we'll be able to complete it today. I mean, it's going to take a whole lot of wood to really complete it. But uh, um, <laughs> free. <laughs> a over deer says that he's my uh, my winged minion. Wow, <laughs> he's wearing a mask too, but not quite the same mask as me. So that's pretty cool. He's unique on the look there, but he's wearing these wings. These wings are a fad, guys. They're an awesome fad. So uh, I, I like my wings anyway. So let's um let's get to uh, putting all this in here. Once we have all this in here, guys, I'll be right back, and we will start building. Um, the garage hopefully we'll be able to get a lot of it done at least and then uh, put the shelves up and then put all of this stuff that's just cluttered everywhere on them shelves so I'll be right back see one thing that kind of sucks guys about this setup is this thing seems to get stuck and I have no idea why I really wish I I really wish this thing would just push wood like it's supposed to but look at it because there's wood over here on the other side of it it gets stuck. It gets confused when wood gets on the opposite side of the claws. And I have no idea why it should just work no matter what I, I think. And it just doesn't. Um, so I'm hopefully, I don't know, if you guys can maybe show this video to Defaultio. If you could kind of look at the problem that I'm having here and see. The wood's getting stuck here. It, it's Look at that. Look at that. This thing is not moving. And now I move this piece of wood. Oh wait, there's a little piece of wood right here. And that is stopping it, I believe. And it's just stuck now. It's it's glitched out. So it's not going to move at all now. Awesome. All right, well, hopefully, I don't know, hopefully Defaultio fixes that sometime in the future. If he even knows it's an issue, I don't know. But um, look at that. Look at that. I don't know if it's because the wood's too close to the edge or what. But it is legit not able to push this little piece of wood. It's supposed to push it. Ugh. Frustrations of working with um, automatic setups in this game. I don't know how, what I can do to improve that. So if you guys have any ideas on how I can improve that and make it work better. Because the thing's not pushing the wood like it's supposed to. I mean the wood's just... Still getting stuck. If it pushed it like it was supposed to, I would never have any problems. The wood would go onto the next platform and it would move. But for some reason, it's just not pushing it like it's supposed to. If it's a big piece like that, then it just, you know, it works. But all the small pieces will not get pushed. I don't know. I have no idea. Alright, guys. So, now, I'm a little bit iffy on this. This is palm wood. Um... Obviously, I have not found any way yet to be able to get this legitimately, so I'm not sure 
how Overdeer came into it, but uh, um, it's a donation, and I gotta, I guess I gotta start being careful about what I'm taking because I don't know at, at what point all this stuff is going to register. I feel like something, I just feel like something is gonna trigger the automatic ban system, and I don't want that to happen. I, I appreciate all the donations, but guys, if there is things that uh, um, that are obtained um, incorrectly, as in through glitch or anything like that, um, I probably shouldn't take any more of that stuff from you guys, just because too much of that stuff is going to set off the automatic ban system, and if this account gets banned, that'd be really bad for all of us. So. Please don't get me banned, guys. <laughs> I love you guys. You're awesome. And um, I love all the donations. And I thank you all for everything that you give me. But please don't get me banned. <laughs> so, um, all right. So we are uh, um, now um, adding. We have more white wood. That white wood is piling up like crazy. And another big shout out to Overdeer again for uh, donating some even, even more axes. He donated some... Uh, um, fire axes and some alpha axes so that's awesome guys you guys have been flooding me with freaking gifts and that's it's awesome that love wall is getting so big um we are almost done processing all this white wood i only have like two big pieces left here to process and um then i can start this building so i'm gonna take the truck over there i should have i always forget to back the truck over there oh why do i always forget that I always forget to back the truck up to the freaking thing so that way it can just load right into the truck. Alright guys, so I'm back here. We have a massive pile of white wood now. I mean, look at this. Um, wow. I wanted to send some money to Overdeer for helping me out um, in getting this wood, but for some reason, if you guys see here... I click on his name and I click transfer. Oh, there it goes. Now it says transfer pending. All right, so it worked that time. It didn't work last time. Close. Okay, so so there's that. Now I just need to put as much of this over there as I can. But yeah, so that was for over dear uh, helping me get the wood and bring it back to the base. So a big shout out to him and thanks for all that and the um, gifts and stuff that he gave me. I can never repay everything that you guys have given me, but it definitely makes this series more interesting and um, that is the best way I know to uh, um, to kind of give back to you guys is to make this the best series possible. And I hope it makes you guys happy and makes you guys smile. And um, I know this is my most popular series, so I don't want to mess that up, that's for sure. So... I love you guys, and let me uh, finish adding all this to this truck, and I'll be right back. All right, guys, so I have a big pile in the back of my truck here. This should get us um, rather far into this, and I think I have an idea on what to do with my extra blue wood there. I think I'm going to use them for shelves because I have I have some extra blue wood uh, walls, and we're just going to park this truck right here. Hopefully this truck doesn't wig out on me. Because I've had that happen several times before, and it's never a fun thing. When it wigs out on you, <laughs> trust me, you don't ever want the truck to wig out, because it will. It'll go crazy. I'm, And you, you think I'm joking. No, it will go crazy. Like, it'll be doing, like, a little dance, and then it'll fling itself across the world, and because trucks are buggy as crap in this game. Uh, all right, so we're about to finish this up here. We're definitely close. Remember, we're still going to have to do a second layer, and we're going to have to put shelves in. All right, so we're we're getting there, although that truck is going to be problematic, I think. I don't know how it got in there sideways. I parked it in, like, legitimately the correct way, and now it's sideways. So, I don't know how that happened. Like, I logged out and it was good. I logged back in and now it's funky. It's funky, funky, funky. And not funky fresh. Just funky. Like, it, <laughs> it's it's on its side. That is definitely not funky fresh. I think I'm going to start by putting shelves on the, this wall, though. 
and um, we'll go from there but right now here we're gonna grab some of these so we can make some shelves alright so like this first one here is he chopping himself in oh, okay I thought he was chopping himself in half or something and I was about to be like what why right there look at that okay so now we have um one shelf and now we have a second shelf so let's see if we can fill this whole area up with blue wood walls that would be freaking cool and we can clear out some of this area that has just been cluttered for the longest time and it has been bugging the crap out of me alright so now this is the last one here that I can fit in there so we have a shelf system kind of uh, um, so that's freaking cool and like now we can put stuff on the shelves okay so now we can put that right there my OCD is kicking in guys no no oh man oh man oh man okay my OCD is gonna go crazy if this is not lined up like perfectly why am I so OCD why why you do this to me why why guys why okay whatever that's that's good enough so at least we'll have the first layer of the garage done and we have some of this area cleaned up which is freaking awesome because quite literally it was so freaking cluttered it was insane this is gonna bug me if the box is upside down. I have no idea why. It just is. Oh dang it! There we go. So we got that. I got some more of these too. I mean, wow, I got a lot of stuff here. I definitely need to needed this organization. I mean, this was this was a long time coming. I mean, we were starting to get really cluttered with a whole bunch of stuff. So let's put this one up here as well oh come on are you serious right now now I'm gonna have to flip this all the way around come on just stay on the freaking shelf man what the heck there we go oh jeez. okay so now I got this thing which we can put back there Alright, so now we have we, we have a good storage system set up so far. We've cleared out a lot of a lot of space. Oh, we can even throw this dynamite up on the shelf too. So we're gonna throw this right here. Okay, and these things now, we're gonna put these under the shelf. So we're gonna move these. Okay, and these will be a lot easier to place. Um why is it like that? T okay. Okay, so we're going to put those under the shelf just for storage. I think they're upside down, but I don't care. I don't really care if they're upside down. I just want to get them under the shelf so that way they're out of the way and they're not in the middle of everything. I feel like this is a better storage spot for everything, although I want to I need more room on the other side, especially for these uh, um, stilt things that I have here. Alright guys, so we've cleaned up a lot of the clutter here. Now we have some excess wood around here. Most of this is going to despawn whenever I log out. But, oh man, it's been a, a long journey just to get to the point to where we are at right now. But look at this, look at this storage. Nice, tidy, organized, awesome. So that's cool. Now I want this truck out of here, but I feel like it's going to be a problem trying to get this out of here. Nope, nope, nope. Look at that, guys. I am an expert pro. <laughs> I said, oh, are you okay? <laughs> Was just moving my truck, guys. All right, so... I think it's cool that I left this gap here so that way and I think that's how I'm gonna leave it this big gap here but I do want to make the walls um, at least one higher at least one higher and then we're gonna work on a roof um, 
I don't know if I want to make, I think I kind of want to make a second floor or in like uh, stairs or something leading up to them. Now I want to put this truck in where it goes. I don't know if I can kind of maneuver it around in here. Yes. Yes, 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 yes. Okay, look at that, guys. That's that MLG parking skills right there. Boom. Yes. Okay, so my garage is like set. Now I just need more shelves on that side. I don't think they're going to be blue shelves, just simply because um, I don't have that much more blue wood. And this is in... This is stuck here. Like, legit stuck here and I do not think oh there we go I thought for a minute there I was not gonna be able to get it out but I was I did get it out alright so now we have some more stuff here I think we're gonna throw this over to the love wall and yeah so let me put this over here alright guys so alright so I have some more white wood here now we're gonna start by making some walls on the ground okay so we're gonna make a smooth wall and then what we're gonna do from there see how we can do that and then we're gonna move it and put it up like that see and that's how we're gonna build is we're gonna make the walls on the ground and then we're gonna move them up so, alright guys so another shout out to the Roblox Panda Plays for coming in here and playing and uh, he also brought me uh, some uh, some more Pumpkins. I'm gonna have to like decorate these around and put these around the base or something like that. I mean that would be freaking epic. I'm gonna ha have him put them right there for a night right now, but I got a bunch of them, so I think guys, I might decorate the base in kind of uh, um, a pumpkin thing. All right, guys. So I'm almost done here with this, and um, I was just asked a question about fan T-shirts in in Roblox. And guys, I do have fan t-shirts. I have three of them, in fact. Um, if you guys join my group, which is Dark J Gaming, so search groups on Roblox, and uh, check the um, group store, and you and I have them set to the bare minimum price. And guys, the um, the Roblox robot uh, Roblox earned from that goes towards funding the VIP servers. Um, for the games I play, which is Miner's Haven and Lumber Tycoon 2. It also goes towards uh, group advertisement, which um, which helps the uh, group expand and allows more people to know about the group and in turn helps grow this community. So if you guys wanted to help out with that, then uh, get yourself one of those fan shirts. And uh, um, there's three stylish um, shirts. There is uh, one that looks exactly like the one that I'm wearing. Then there's one with a uh, big like bow tie on it, and then there's one that looks like a suit. So yeah, go check those out, guys. They're pretty freaking cool. Also, um, guys, I do have a Discord, and there is a link to the Discord in every description of every video that I do. So if you guys wanted to join that, join in on the conversations that I have there, then uh, um, that would be awesome as well. I, I love it when you guys uh, come in into my Discord and join in on the conversations. It's it's a fun time. So, guys, be sure to join in. And, um, well, that's the last piece that I have there. Yeah, so I think it's time for me to end this uh, episode. So, a big shout-out to everybody that was in here today. We filled the server once again, guys, because you guys are freaking amazing. And that's all I can say. Just... You guys are awesome. So thank you for being awesome. If you like this video, be sure to hit that like button, guys. Subscribe if you haven't already or if you're just new to my channel. And as always, guys, stay awesome. I'm Dark J, and I'm out. So guys, I'm going to have to put these presents up on the love wall. That's, yeah, okay. You know what? Perfect. Boom. Look at that parking job, guys. That is... That is some perfect parking right there. Oh, yes.